Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and this is my 544th Energy Drink Review video. Um, it's 5.28pm, and it's, um, Wednesday, September 2nd, 2015. Um, my eye looks dark, but it's just because of the shadow. You know what I mean? But anyway, um, today I'm going to be reviewing the last one of the brand new Joker energy drinks. These are exclusive to Circle K. And it was two dollars, but right now they're having a promotion that's buy two for three dollars, so you know. So it's good if you buy it when it's like that price. So yeah, today I'm going to be reviewing the last flavor. So today I'm going to be reviewing the Fruit Punch Joker Mad Energy Energy Drink. Oh yeah. So we're top with a black tab. It says taurine and L-carnitine and B vitamins all the way around the top of it. Joker Fruit Punch Mad Energy. Artificially flavored fruit punch energy drink. Two servings with caffeine. 16 fluid ounces, one pint, 473 milliliters. Has a Joker. He's wearing a blue, green, and red hat with magic eight balls. Has a cool, like, spades, like, playing card design. Has SKU, some codes, and a crown. Proudly distributed by Circle K Stores Incorporated. P.O. Box 52085 Phoenix, Arizona. 85072 www.circlek.com This product is not recommended for pregnant or nursing women, children, and or others sensitive to caffeine. Not mixed with alcoholic beverages. Caffeine content 70 mg per 8 fluid ounces serving. So has 140 mg of caffeine. This can contains two servings, not exceed more than two servings, one can during a 24 hour period. Has the ingredients, contains 0% juice. Nutrition facts, serving size 8 fluid ounces, servings per container 2. Calories 120, total fat 0 grams, 0%. Sodium 150 milligrams, 6%. Total carbohydrates 31 grams, 10%. Sugars 30 grams, protein 0 grams. Niacin 100%, vitamin B6 100%, vitamin B12 100%, panathenic acid 100%. Actually, my eye does feel like it's hurting, but mm, it doesn't look bad though. So I don't know. Being well, show off the can. My lighting keeps changing for some reason. There's the Joker, he looks pretty cool. Okay, I'll let you see like the designs on the side and stuff, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, I love the Joker energy drink so far, they're cheap, they taste good, and they work good. So anyway, I'm going to shake it up, open it, taste it, and get my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it. Oh yeah, it's not like Hawaiian punch. It's not like, um, the Rockstar Fruit Punch. Oh yeah, this smells exactly like Baller's Blend. 
which is my favorite fruit punch energy drink. Oh, it smells exactly like it. The color is like exactly the same too. It's like a purplish, pinkish, red color. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably going to taste like Baller's Blend. Oh yeah. Okay, I'm excited now. Ooh, am I going to try it? Um, Baller's Blend is more smoother. This has more carbonation. Um, but it's basically the same flavor as Baller's Blend, though. It's just not as smooth. It has a fizzy filling when it goes down your throat. Yeah, but it tastes like Baller's Blend. So this is really good. I like it. It's like banana, cherry, pineapple, you know, fruit punch, the good stuff. I like it. Um, I like it. Um, Energy-wise, it lasts about four and a half hours to five and a half hours, so it works pretty good. It's cheap. It's, like, best if you buy it right now during the promotion, though, since they just came out with them. It's buy two for three dollars. Normally, it's two dollars. So, price-wise, I'd recommend Rippets more, because they're only one dollar. Um, but still, sort of cheap. I know it's cheaper than the Monsters at that gas station, because the monsters there are two dollars and thirty cents before tax. This is two dollars before tax, so it's a little bit cheaper than like monsters. Um, the best place to get monsters though is at Walmart, because they're only a dollar eighty-eight. Um, but anyway, this tastes good. It works good. It's sort of cheap. I love the can design. Um, I don't know if it's my favorite Joker though. I really like the Tropical Mango one and the original one, um, but this one's still really good. I actually like all the Jokers. This Cherry Lime one is like the Red Rain Downpour. Um, so I actually like all the Joker energy drinks. So my least favorite is the Ultimate Zero one. But yeah, I definitely recommend you trying this brand. They're only available at Circle K. So try to get these. I give the Fruit Punch Joker Mad Energy Energy Drink. I give it a 9 out of 10. It's really good. It tastes like um, the Baller's Blend Punch Monster Energy Drink. Except it's not as smooth, but still has that same flavor. So it's really good. So I definitely recommend you trying this. It's really good. Definitely. Definitely try it. Definitely try this brand. This whole brand is really good. All the flavors. It's just amazing. I highly recommend the Joker energy drinks. Okay. My next review is most likely going to be the Monster M100 Ghost energy drink. My package should be arriving in the mail this week. So that will probably be my next review. Um, yesterday, my car sort of had a problem. Um... Actually, it's really messed up what happened. My mom's truck broke down at her work after she got home. Um, like, I was going to take her to Walmart to get a battery. But on the way there, my car died. <sighs> this is really messed up. And then my mom told me to put in, like, neutral so I can, like, try to get out of my road and, like, get into my driveway. Because I was like, or by the stop sign, which is right by my house, so it was not that far. Um, but I guess the road was going downhill and was speeding my car up, and it wouldn't let me stop it. So I went in my ditch, so that sucked. So we got it out, we got in my carport. Um, but now I have to get my car fixed, 
I guess the timing belt like broke. So that sucks. It's gonna be like three hundred dollars. I also had to pay my car payment. So I was gonna get those two pain relieving shots. This check at Circle K, but now I may not be able to, so now I might have to wait. But we'll see how much money I have left over. I might have enough to get them. Because there's only two pain relieving shots that I had to get. Um, yeah, but since my car is messed up, I can't go to Oklahoma City and get Pipeline Punch. So that really sucks. But it's supposed to be available all the way through December. Um, so I'll try to get it soon. Hopefully, um, there's a lot of rumors going around there's going to be false flags or some sort of big stuff happening this month. Around September 20th through the 28th. Um, there's rumors of a financial collapse, a meteor, alien invasion, all sorts of crazy stuff like earthquakes and like um, EMP. So a lot of crazy stuff might happen, but I'm hopefuling, I'm praying and stuff that's not going to happen. Because you know if that happens, you know, Illuminati, just saying. But anyway, just stay tuned for my upcoming reviews, stay tuned for more videos, thanks for watching, see you guys later. Peace out. And I might be doing another trade with TPX soon. I might be trying to get an old discontinued Java monster, so maybe look forward to that review too. Also, yesterday I found out they're coming out with three brand new Mountain Dew Kickstarts. Coming out with a new flavor of the Hydrating Boost Mountain Dew Kickstarts. It's going to be Watermelon. And then they're coming out with a brand new type of Mountain Dew Kickstart. It's called Mountain Dew Kickstart Recharge. There's going to be two flavors. Blueberry Pomegranate and Blood Orange. So I'm definitely waiting to try those flavors. They're probably going to be good. Yeah, just stay tuned for more reviews. Thanks for watching. See you guys later.